For our research interests over in uh, School of Pharmacy, we use H35 and I2 hypoxia workstation. Our research interests in our group includes exploiting the tumour cell uh, energy metabolism in order to improve gynaecological cancer treatment. Gynaecological cancers in nature are hypoxic uh, solid tumours, that's why we are interested in performing our experiments under hypoxia at different oxygen tensions, whereby we can actually mimic the um, environmental conditions that we will see in actual tumours. Gynecological cancers are known to have high glycolysis rate and increased lactate concentration due to the reduced oxygen levels which we call this hypoxia. We know that increased glycolysis rate and lactate concentration does lead to um, reduction in survival rate and uh, reduction in overall outcome from these patients. Our work using uh, the Don Whitley's hypoxia workstation includes uh, measuring profiling of the gynecological cancer cell lines in order to determine um, their glycolytic capacity under the treatment of the glycolytic stress compounds that you can get from seahorse biosciences. By using these compounds in combination uh, with our cell lines, we have been able to actually identify possible glycolytic inhibitors which would improve the treatment outcome in these patients. We first seed our cells on plates and then incubate these cells overnight for 24 hours or for the duration of the experiment of the treatment that we are interested in. So the next day the samples are transferred through the transfer tunnel into the um, I2 chamber. This chamber does provide us the environment that we need to do our analysis by using the Seahorse XF analyzer. The unique thing about I2 is that it has no CO2 in it and it has slightly reduced temperature so that the Seahorse analyzer can function. We also have got an internal um, incubator which allows us to keep the cells at 37 degrees in a non-CO2 environment at 3% oxygen, which is the oxygen level that you can do your metabolic measurements at, for an hour until the media and the cells are equilibrated to the non-CO2 environment. After this, we then follow the uh, manufacturer's protocol provided the XF Biosciences and um, do actual metabolic measurements on the cells with and without the glycolytic inhibitors. In future, we are hoping to combine these glycolytic inhibitors that we have identified with the help of the dual hypoxic workstation and the Seahorse XF analyzer with chemotherapy and or radiotherapy in order to improve the treatment outcome for the, for the gynecological cancer patients, especially the ones which has got the tumours that are more resistant to the therapies that are available.